Hey, what is up guys? Today I want to do an update on my 2002 Dodge Ram 1500. And I want to answer some of your guys' comments about the Rough Country suspension kit that I installed a couple months ago. And I'm also going to be installing some new tires soon, so stay tuned at the end of the video for that. So the number one question you guys asked me is, how does a Rough Country suspension ride? Again, I put a three inch rough country suspension um, on the truck. In my opinion, rides pretty shitty. So my kit came with two springs, four shocks. It also came with two blocks and two clamps for the blocks. But as you can see, the mechanic did put the blocks back here, also the clamps because he said if you put the blocks back here, the back would be taller than the front. And I did the measurement from rim to rim, and the truck came out pretty even. But I have no blocks to show you, because the mechanic kept them. I also don't have a sticker to put them on my refrigerator at work. So the bottom line is, you're gonna get what you pay for. If you wanna spend a little bit more money and buy an expensive kit, you're probably gonna get better quality. Uh, I bought this 3 inch rough country and uh, I'm okay with it. And I know some of you guys are going to say, well Pedro, you were super excited in your first video. Alright, here it is guys. Got my 3 inch lift kit. Super stoked. Super stoked. Of course I was. It was my first lift kit and it made the truck look good. So what I recommend lift kit? Now back to those mud terrain tires. All right guys, so just got the uh, Dirt Turns Trivia installed on the truck. Driving home, about to get on the freeway, about to get on the traffic freeway, which I shouldn't even have freaking done. You kidding me? I should not have taken this route. That's what I get for being excited. So now you guys can't look and hear how those tires sound. My apologies because of California traffic. I'm going, I'm going, car. So thank you for letting me go in. Oh, that's that guy. That's the guy who did the tires. So the tires do look good. Um, they, uh, they do look good and um, Basically, um, they they sound good. I don't know if you guys can hear it. I got the windows up and uh, I don't see a major noise. Plus it's like the wind is crazy out there right now. We've had, I haven't seen one like this in a long time. Um, hey guys, I wanna pause the video real quick. In that clip, my hand was shaking. It's not the tires. Um, I don't have a phone holder on my in, in my truck, so I wanted to clarify that really quickly. So let's keep it going. So yeah, but for the most part, they they look pretty good. The only thing that I would I would say is that some of the other the only thing that I would say is that honestly, some of the other tires, whether you have 17s, whether you have 18s, uh, they feel like you can get. A higher um, you can basically get a higher a higher look you know to say and and with that higher look I think you know basically the trucks going to be he be taller um, and that'll work in, in definitely a, a benefit of mine based on the you know the, the the rough country lift kit that I got it's not the highest you know so adding a little bit more height would have been good um, rather than but i mean in this case i'm going wide i went 33 uh 12 50 20s so um that's uh that's to be expected so so yeah again got the uh dirt turn trivia uh, mud terrain tires 33 12 50 20s and this is what it sounds like on the freeway
here's the first look of the truck. You can see it doesn't stick out a whole bunch. Just a little bit. About an inch or so. And I got the sticker right there. Not too bad. It actually makes the rims look a lot smaller. Alright guys, so let me know what do you guys think? Let me know if you want me to do another video on these dirt turns uh, after so often. There you see the 30, 33, 12, 50, 20s. Um, they're not bad. I like them. I think it gives the truck a little meaner look. Like I said earlier, definitely makes the rims look smaller. So here's the final result of the truck. So let me know if you want to see another video uh, a couple months from now. See how these tires are doing. So yeah guys, I like the rough country lift kit. I don't have money to spend on expensive kits. Plus it makes the truck look good. And it's not like the mud tires are going to make it any better. But I like the way it looks. So that's my opinion. If you like that video, hit that thumbs up button. And also subscribe to the channel for the newest videos.